Yo, what is going on there, everybody? Ace the Game here, and welcome back. I know it's been a while since I did this. This is the best class setup. This is my very first video here on Call of Duty Black Ops 3 for the best class setup series. And if you guys do enjoy the best class series, let me know by smacking that like button. And let me know in the comment section below how you guys have been, because it's been a while since I did this, and I kind of want to, you know, start out doing this series again. So without further ado, guys, here we go. And today, we're looking at the CUDA SMG. This is the very first SMG you unlocked. As you can see here, I have the gun on. Fully, you know, nice golden camo and all that cool stuff. But you wanna go ahead and attach the weapon. It is a fully automatic submachine gun, which is pretty much the best balanced recoil weapon. And for the optics, don't put any. But for the attachment, because for the optic, the Kuda has one of the, the best uh, iron sights ever so you don't really need that so for the equipment first we're gonna go with quick draw uh, so you can aim faster while after you know after you sprint and all that cool stuff so you get those little quick draw and fast kills and for the second attachment you're gonna go and unlock the grip because the accuracy does get increased with the grip it's pretty cool because Kuda kind of lacks accuracy you know because it is a submachine gun you know all submachine guns mainly you know are only for close combat purposes so you want to go ahead and do that and you want to go ahead and also have a third equipment I mean uh, excuse me attachment so you want to go ahead and put on the primary gunfighter if you don't have it already put get the primary gunfighter one so you can put an additional attachment slot for your primary weapon so you can get and get that and if you guys do have the stock unlocked I do suggest you guys to get stock because you know it makes you move faster while you're aiming and that's pretty much you know Really, really important with submachine guns to be able to move faster and get those kills quicker. And for the secondary, go ahead and get, you know, you use the XM53, you know, to take care of those UAV, get those nice, you know, extra points for your leveling up. And for the lethal, go ahead and use, I prefer you guys use Simtex because Simtex are, you know, it feels better than a frag, you know, it has a, you know, a faster cook time than frag grenades. And for perk number one, go ahead and use Afterburner. Perk number two, use fast hands, because fast hands are really, really important for submachine guns, because you know submachine guns, you know, they spit out a whole lot of ammo, so you need to, you know, once you're out of ammo, you have fast hands, you know, you reload quicker. And then for the perk number three, get gun ho. It makes you, you know, your weapon's hit fire ability, you know, it increases, and also makes you deploy equipment faster and throw a grenade while sprinting, which is pretty much cool, you know. But there it is guys, let me put back my golden camo real quick here. There it is. If you guys did enjoy the video, please don't forget to smack that like button. Subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos. Like always guys, thanks for watching, have a nice day, and peace out.